What up, bitches? We're in Jimmy John's. Uh, the song's over, and I'm about to do the robot, man. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, here comes another one. Here comes another one. All right, videotape me for it. This really isn't uh, the music for this. What is this some David Bowie shit? I don't know, but it's garbage, man. Wait, let's do the moonwalk. I can't even do it for me. Okay. I'm gonna dance till I can't no more. When you come through the door, find me on the floor. Cause I'm gonna dance till I can't no more. When you come through the door, find me on the floor. One second, let me get the settings down. This is our first go around. And be happy and smiley. Okay. okay. I'd like to thank Keith from Kelfus for being here cleaning our windows and our mirrors. They did an excellent job. This is the first time we've had him here, and I'm sure that we'll have him here year after year because of the excellent cleaning that they've done when they left here. You couldn't tell that they did any work at all. Everything shines so good. The, the windows are just like crystal. They sparkle and they are they work very hard. And we're very pleased and we would recommend them to all of our friends and families. Perfect. And then one more thing, we put your hand back on his. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Water for the pole, cleaning windows huge house over 140 windows in this house force is good at it too look at that water fed pole with one hand scrubbing everything. Every nook and cranny and crevice and all the cobwebs and spider webs thoroughly, all the dirt. And you're gonna let the water sheet down the glass to the boar's head brush. It's got hundreds of, thousands of contact points that agitate all the dirt in the glass. The ionized water, now that he's sheeting it down the glass, you see, it's gonna rinse. It's sheeting all the dirt particles. The ionized water is hungry water. It sucks all the, any, uh, minerals off the, gl the glass, calcium, magnesium deposits. If you were to do that with regular tap water, what it would do is it would leave spots. This dries crystal clear. Kind of, kind of beat the rain here. A little bit of water seeking in. That's why I'm standing here at this account, especially. Water seeps in. See that? I bring a whole bucket of towels with me. Cause you, you do a water-fed pull to a house that you don't know the sills. One out of hundred, one out of a hundred houses, or say one out of. 50 houses, I don't know. But you do it and you get wood all over someone's mahogany wood floors, water on their floors, dude, you're donezo. So, one thing to look out for. You should drink it. Drink it. He's drinking it. It's good. <laughs> he's, he's drinking ionized water. It's awesome. So if I'm cleaning a customer's windows and I mess up their rug, these sh uh, shag fibers like that, I literally will kneel down and fix it. Because you never know how meticulous people are and how many little things they notice down to the microscopic piece of dust. I literally think on that level because they think on that level. That's what I think. 
Another thing is, done cleaning a customer's windows, Swiffer, all their hardwood floors. How do you know you didn't leave a drop of water? A single drop of water. Swiffer, all the floors. And when I'm done cleaning all the windows, I do final inspection very slowly and calmly. And look at this, I found an entire window that was missed and wasn't done. So now we gotta get out all the equipment again and redo this one window, period. Literally, if you even see a speck that's eye level. In this video, I wanna talk about stress and managing stress. Last month, I was super stressed out to the point of like, <laughs> sick in the head, stressed out, getting no sleep. And uh, I, got a, I got a coach that I call when I'm going through stuff, right? And he helps me organize the neurons in my brain. But anyways, he said something I wanna share with you that was powerful. I was like, uh, hey, uh, Rob is his name. You've seen him in my videos. I'm like, dude, I'm so stressed out. I, I got so much going on, I can't even physically do it all, right? And after I explained it all to him, he goes, well, it sounds like your train isn't set up enough. He's speaking metaphors. You can't take turns at such high speeds yet because you don't have the foundation in place to do that or the structure in place in your business and your life. There's not enough uh, like strong uh, integrity or he'll call it like crazy words like masculine consciousness which would be like the consciousness of like of a general or a king or a CEO or something like that your consciousness would be really tuned and developed he says so you can, your train can't take turns at such high speeds man the sun's right in my eyes he says what, what I would suggest is slowing the train down temporarily so you can take those turns at high you know it's slower and I said oh slow the train down slow down everything and it's worked tremendously for it right, I gotta take this call <clears throat> hello and the most important part of having your own or starting your own window cleaning business you gotta eat good food bitches we're at Las Tortugas amazing delicious Mexican food it's gonna be amazing they love you man Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs>
because the blinds are in the way. These little tabs sometimes they'll be beaten by the sun and all wilted out. You'll pull it and it'll just break and fall off. So you, sometimes you can give a screen a little bit of force, but I mean, if you can't break it. Normally you want to tell the customers that they got to remove all screens before we get here. Because if you pull a screen out and it breaks in your hand, now you got to fix a screen that was already broken. You know what I'm saying? And also jiggling, never underestimate the power. Just kind of jiggling a screen it works too. You just keep jiggling it until it comes out, but never force it or bend it. Whenever I open up any blinds, I always push with my hand at the same time to help assist it. All the way to the top, because if you pull a blind and you don't assist it, you should also tell the customer, which we didn't do here, that they got to, um, I gotta tell Forrest, damn it. Oh. Can you uh, either adjust the water fed pole brush so it's angled up more or get closer so the plastic doesn't hit? Okay, because if the plastic hits the, if it's UV protector or anything, or scratches the UV, or you know what I mean. See how I can't get it past that, and this end won't come off because it's screwed in. So you're gonna have to bend it a little bit out. That's what I usually get, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, the massage chairs at lunchtime, bitches. That's why the camera be shaking. Oh, whoa, that feels good, eh? <laughs> like bosses, man. It's always nice to stop and do a little work to just relax for a few hours. The extended lunch break. Oh god, not even Italian. I don't know. Water fed pole. Yeah. No ladders, dude. That's so awesome. Look how high up that is. That's crazy. 35 feet. <laughs> 